using the katana into like a Filipino martial arts drill. So angles, angle one, angle two, angle three, angle four, angle five, angle six, angle seven, angle eight, and thrust for nine. Let's break that down. Angle one and two is the high X, okay? You could cut through and reset, cut through and reset, or you can cut and retract, cut and retract, your choice. Okay, angle one and two. Now you have angle three and four. Again, I can cut through or I can cut and pull, cut and pull. Three, four, now five, six, five, six. It's the upward figure eight. One and two are the downward figure eight. Five and six are the upward figure eight. Seven, straight up and down. Blade up, blade down. Now, seven is cool. I can go this side and down, or I can go this side and down. The thing we don't want to do is we don't want to pull up because we're going to disarm ourselves off of our weapon. So you don't pull up, but you actually blade up and then down and then thrust for a nine. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Other option, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. So in Kali, we have the high X. And so again, you could just do this right here. We call this Ikus in Filipino martial arts. In sword, angle one, angle two. And then you can do high, low, high, and then high X to high, low, high. High X, high, low, high. High X and high, low, high. So if we take that, and we put it now in some defenses. If I go like this, this is where the blade is pointed down, AKA blade down, okay? And I shade, okay? Into the inside sweep, into a shield defense. And that's for a defense of a downward strike, a shomenuchi, a yoko manuchi, an angled strike, and a yaku yoko manuchi, a reverse angle strike, the opposite side. Open side, closed side angle, reverse angle, right? So straight down, angle, angle. So I go here to here to here. And then what I can do is I can ping pong that. I can feed my target while they do the defense. And this is the sombrata drill from Filipino martial arts into a sword drill, okay? And how do we get in? How do we get out? How do we play with this? So I can do the high X into these three drills, or I can go high, low, high into these three drills, or I can mix the two together into these three drills. So that's something you guys can play with, but that's all I want to kind of give you is something simple, something easy. We've been doing sword work this week in our gym here at my gym, Kisha Dojo, and so I thought it might be fun to see this with the high X, okay? into the high, low, high, high, low, high. Understand I'm stepping back because that's a low line strike. I don't wanna lose my leg. So it doesn't have to be behind you, okay? It could just be off to the side, okay? All, all the Kali stuff that we do. And then finally I mix the two together, high X to the high, low, high. Something I've been thinking about and doing in my own class lately is Guru Dan, when he teaches the Kali stuff, he'll say one, two, one, which is an angle one, an angle two, an angle one. And then we'll do something with the one, two, one. And I've been playing with that my own. One, two, then one, low, high. One, two, one, low, high. Which, again, if we follow the angles, it's one, two, one, six, two. You can do that, but I find it easier teaching my students if I say one, two, one, 
low high and they're getting it better and maybe that'll help you guys at home. If I switch my lead for the camera, so now I'm in my left, but this looks like my right, and then low high. One, two, one, low high. Remember whatever side you're on, that hand's on top, opposite hand's on the bottom, that leg is in front, okay? So my right side, one, two, one, low high, one, two, one, low high. And so that's just simply a, the five count, um, five count Filipino martial arts drill, but tied into the katana. And then we also added in the three core strikes and then into the sombrata drill, which means shade for shade. And then I also showed you the martial arts limited angles of attack when it comes to the stick, the spear, the staff, and the sword. Cool. Well, you guys made it to the end of the video. You know what to do. Hit that like button if you like the stuff you see on our channel. Go ahead and smash that subscribe button. Boom, that really helps us out with the whole YouTube algorithm thing. Don't forget to uh, share this video if you like it and maybe share it with some fi family and friends or whoever might be interested. And then last but not least, hit that bell icon, a ding ding, and then that way you can be notified when all the other videos are coming out from all of us here at Martial Arts Limited. You guys are awesome, keep your blades up. This is Sensei JD, and I'm out.